What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back on Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. This will be going up on Thanksgiving. And so, I hope you all had a great one, spent time with family or friends. Uh, if you don't celebrate Thanksgiving, hope you had a great day today. Uh, but it is time to hop back into some Pokemon. Uh, just got done with all my family festivities, so it should be... Should be going up pretty late. It's about 10 o'clock right now, so we'll record, upload, and then I'll probably set it live around midnight Eastern. So I had a little bit of a save issue. Uh, I guess it didn't save, so we reverted back to a previous save. So I had to go through and re-catch Onyx and Chansey. Um, you can see in the box here we have an extra Onyx and an extra Chansey. Um, it just was a little bit hard to find... Uh, the Pokemon again, and then when I was leaving, I found another Onyx and another Chansey, so I thought I thought it worth it to catch them. So there's actually a couple of new Pokemon here on the route. I um, believe we have to get kind of lucky. So there's the Mankey. This is at least one new Pokemon that I saw. So I wanted to catch these before we actually hit up the gym. So Mankey should be easy to catch. There we go, got the nice. Alright, so there's the Mankey grabbed. 59 XP, nice. Chansey got the 13. Everybody's leveling up very nicely. Uh, Mankey Pokedex added an agile Pokemon that lives in trees. It angers easily and will not hesitate to attack anyone. Tucked him away in the box. I don't really want to use, don't want to use the Mankey. So let's go ahead now. I guess we can head. Hold on. Let me check this route one more time. See if we can get any other new spawns. So there's another Mankey. And a I think it's just Mankey, Rattata, and Spiro in that, and and then Route Four. I don't want to look stuff up. I want to find stuff organically, and so because otherwise I'm going to sit at different routes for five decades looking for the exact Pokemon that I want. Because if I want, you know, if I know there's a rare Pokemon on the route, I'm going to sit there and waste extra time trying to find it, and it'll make stuff less cool when I find it. Finding a rare Pokemon, you know, will be much cooler if we don't know it's all that rare. I'll probably look up afterwards. I'll probably start looking up afterwards what's rare on a route, and then I'll know if I found a rare Pokemon. Uh, but it is time. To, let's hit up the Cerulean City Gym. This should be the biggest cakewalk ever, maybe? Yo, champ in the making. Misty, the gym leader of the Cerulean City Gym, is a powerful trainer. You'll need a Pokemon of at least level 15 if you want to challenge her. Show me a Pokemon of at least level 15 if you want to take on this gym. Impressive. I see you have a Pokemon that is at least level 15. In that case, head on in, man. Good luck. Alright. So you can't skip the very first trainer. I don't want to skip any of them. I want to fight them all, but... I always like to see which trainers you can skip in these gyms. Beauty Lily. Goldeen. This is going to be the cakewalk of all cakewalk gyms. Thunder Shock. <laughs> the one shots are going to be so real here. I'll be surprised. Misty might have something to challenge me, but I'll be very surprised if anything actually, like, stands up. Blub blub. 320 bucks. I mean, these are just gonna be easy dubs. Hmm, me? I'm a beautiful girl who glides on the water. Beauty Violet. Shelter. It's just gonna come down if someone has something that's water or something else, so it's not a super effective attack. I still don't think it'll matter. 
I am surprised that that shelter was faster. Did not get the freeze, so that's good. And there's the one shot. Ninety-seven XP. Beauty Violet. I'm soaked. Three hundred and twenty bucks. All right, one more trainer. Did you see that dive just now? Don't you think it's deserving of a gold medal? I don't know. It was a decent dive. A gold medal. I. Beauty Daisy. Seal. This is an ice water, so I don't know if this is going to be super effective. Probably will be... I'm not sure. Yeah, it's still... Oh, it didn't one-shot, though. It was super effective, but it wasn't a one-shot. Aqua Jet was faster than me. I think... Does Aqua Jet get priority? I don't even know. Doesn't matter. Seals down. There's the one sh or the not the one shot. There's the easy kill. 103 XP. Beauty Daisy beat. Your Pokemon totally deserve a gold medal. 320 dollars. And now it's time to fight Misty. Hi, you're a new face. What's your pol er, policy on Pokemon? What's your approach? My policy for battle is an all-out offensive with water-type Pokemon. Misty, the world-famous beauty, is your host. My sweet Pokemon are ready, are you? She have three Pokemon or two? Two. So Psyduck and Star... Is it going to be Star you or Star me? Yeah, these are pretty fair levels. I should be able to... I might have to... He oh, wow, Psyduck lived. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. I'm gonna use Quick Attack to make sure... I finish the Psyduck. I don't want any shenanigans where I don't get the finish there. So, it is star me. I'm gonna... I'm gonna keep battling. I was gonna switch, but... Level 19. We'll definitely two-shot it. I'm just gonna lead it off with a quick attack. And then I'll go for the... Ooh, skull. Oh, down to one health. Got the crit. And it got burned. And there's the burn to finish the Pikachu. I'm going to send out Chansey and just tank with Chansey for a second. I mean, I could finish this without Pikachu, but I don't know in this game if experience, you don't get experience if you don't revive. I'm still not entirely sure on that. So just to be just to be safe, just to be safe. What exactly can Chansey do? Pound, Double Slap, Tail Whip. Chansey gets burned. Okay, immediately come out. Yeah, that burn's actually pretty... That's a pretty strong burn. So I'm gonna swap out to Pikachu... Oh, it used Scold again. Is it going to get the burn off again? Nope, no burn. Alright, let's see if we can get the one shot with the Thunder Shock. No. Actually took a lot less damage than I thought. Alright, do I want to use the Revive again? Wait, that didn't finish... I don't even have to. I don't even have to use this. How did that not... Can Scold not actually faint a Pokemon? I don't know. It's going to cost Misty, though, because there's the L. 
That was a very weird thing, right? I, I don't really know how my Pikachu survived, but 346 XP. Gets it to level 20. So, chance he got to 14. Is that really all the level ups we got? Oh, no. Onyx grew to 14. But that's it. Misty. Wow, you're too much. Three grand for winning. Nice. That's ten great balls. Alright, you can have the Cascade badge to show that you beat me. I read that really weird. You can have the Cascade badge to show that you beat me. You got a Cascade badge from Misty. A Cascade badge makes Pokemon up to level 30 from other trainers listen to you. And you can also have my favorite TM, Scold. TM29 teaches Pokemon the move Scald. Use it on a Pokemon that lives in the water. Alright, easy peasy. Got that easy cleanup. Alright, so... No one waiting for us out here. Let's hit up the Pokemon Center real quick. And I guess that was pretty quick. I knew I'd wipe the floor with her. So we can actually do some other stuff in here in this episode. Get my Chansey and Pikachu back up to full health. Remove the burn from Chansey too. That'll be important. Okay. I think we can head out of here now. Actually, I think if this is a direct remake... Actually, I don't know if they're a direct remake. So one of these houses should let you go to the backyard. And then I believe Fire Red and Leaf Green in the backyard was a rare candy. Was a hidden rare candy. I don't know why this... I vividly remember this so much, but... I believe... Oh, maybe it's just... Yeah, see? Rare candy. I don't know if that was in the original, but I do remember for sure it was in Fire and Leaf Green. Actually, pretty happy that I even partially remembered that. Alright. This is the bike path, right? What a shame that people here were robbed. Someone even saw in Steve's escape and they say it were more, or it was none other than Team Rocket. Maybe not. Okay, so... This is Trainer Bridge, right? I... I uh, oh, Nick, you've got to... You're not going to believe this. Uh, uh, poke... It, it, it got... What? How does this lead to a battle? Trainer Blake, Pidgey, the one thing I never like about these Pokemon games is that the opponents never have six Pokemon, so you're always at a huge, enormous advantage over everybody in this game. There's Pidgey down on one shot, and, and Blake's Pokemon are just pathetically weak. Level 18 for Pidgey. Oddish. I don't even think I have a Pokemon to deal with Oddish even if I wanted to. Could send out my own Oddish against Oddish, but... We'll set it with some double kicks. I mean, it's kind of hard because there's not really anything for me to use. Oh, Poison Powder, of course. You gotta be extra annoying, just don't you? You just gotta be extra annoying. I'm gonna take more damage from this because this is not gonna faint it unless I get another critical, which I highly doubt I'm gonna get. Yeah. Used acid. Hit me with hit me with that. Hit me with oh! It cured itself with the poison. Ooh. Hoo -hoo. Alright, give me the quick attack. I'll really hope this finish. Ah, uh, used a potion. Alright, 
All right, deal some damage, quick attack. Thank you. That was a lot of attack. That was a lot of damage. I'll set it with a quick attack again. Did not think quick attack would do that much damage. 76. Oddish. Wow. Wow. I beat his Pidgey. My Pidgey gets to level 18. I beat his Oddish. My Oddish gets to level 18. That's kind of funny. Uh, how much damage does Razor Leaf do? 55. How much does Absorb? 40. Now nah, I'm going to keep it the way I'm going to leave it the way I have it. All right, Eevee. Still, it's still an Eevee. He hasn't lo he hasn't evolved it yet. It's only level 13 too. I don't know why I use Quick Attack. That was a mistake. Did get priority there. I'm just gonna use it again. It should finish. My Pikachu is too over leveled. 84. And Trainer Blake beat. Phew, okay, I feel a bit calmer now. 520 bucks. Ooh, Pidgey's about to become a Pidgey Odo. Nice. Excited about this. Alright. Pidgey evolved into Pidgey Odo. Pidgeotto's data added. This Pokemon is full of vitality. It constantly flies around its large territory in search of prey. Beautiful. Another Pokemon for the Pokedex. Ha! Deep breaths. Okay, let me try that again. Sorry, it's not like me to lose my cool. There's a house up ahead where this favorite Pokemon... It's just skipping on its own. I literally am not doing anything. I wanted to stop by because I thought maybe I'd get to see some rare Pokemon or something. But what I found, and don't freak out when you hear this, the Pokemon fanatic Bill wasn't there. Instead, there was a Pokemon that talked. Yeesh, just thinking about it gives me the creeps. Don't go in there, Nick. Oh, we're definitely going in there. Alright, so this is the this is the trainer bridge or whatever they call it in this game. People call this Nugget Bridge. Beat us five trainers and win a fabulous prize. Think you got what it takes? I'm pretty sure I got what it takes. Bug Catcher Kale. Venonat. I want Mew to learn, like, Psychic or something, and I'll use Mew all the time, but until Mew has better, like, Mew has Swift as its best move. Like, I can't, I can't use that. Kale, you're not very good. Mew grew to 19. Can you learn something, Mew? No. Mew still hasn't learned anything. Woo, good stuff. 108 bucks, three Pokeballs. I'll take the Pokeballs. I will say one thing about this game. It does feel more like a fanfare game than it does anything else. I mean, it's really easy to level up, and it's really easy to do. Um, is it, or what am I trying to say? It's really easy to level up, which makes it really easy to beat all the trainers, because the trainers are all under-leveled. Okay, so Mew can learn all of these. Let's just... Let's teach Mew Scald. I feel like we need a little variety. We need to use something other than Pikachu. And it can learn Payday and Headbutt. Just gonna teach him all of these. And then we'll just use it. Alright, so we'll learn Payday. What's it got? Pound... Yeah, get rid of... Oops, get rid of Pound. One, two, and ta-da! Mew forgot Pound, and it learned Payday instead. Okay, now party. Okay, let's go ahead and use Mew for a little while. I've been only... I've been using, like, Pikachu exclusively. I think it's time that we mixed it up and used a different Pokemon. Last Alley. Sun out Psyduck. 
Of course, we get the water Pokemon when I don't have Pikachu. Of course. Alright, Mew. Let's go with Headbutt. And the one shot. 64 XP. And beat Last Alley. 200 bucks, three Pokeballs. Alright, Kid in the Hat. Here's number three. It won't be easy. Alright, Youngster Timmy. What do you got for me? A Sand Shrew? Uh, well, too bad I just taught my Mew a water move. You're definitely getting one shot, buddy. Like, see, we're fighting, like, level 10s, and I'm level 19. Like, it's not very fair. This Mew is going to be my ace in the hole. It's just going to be able to learn everything, so... I'll probably have the counters that I won't have already in my party on the Mew. Alright, two more trainers to go. I'm number four, getting tired. Last Rally, or really? Sun out Meowth. I wish, like, at the end of Nugget Bridge, there was, like, a guy with, oh, I don't know, a full party? And actually presented a challenge when you got to him. But I think he has one Pokemon at the end, too. Alright. Final trainer. Okay, I'm number five. I'll stomp you. <laughs> Camper Kevin. Growlithe. Too bad I have a water. Alright. Scold. Good night, Growlithe. Seventy seven experience. Camper Kevin. Whoa, too much. Two twenty, two great balls. Okay. Nice. Okay, are you going to give me my prize? Congratulations, you beat our five trainers. You just earned a fabulous prize. Ooh, a nugget. That's like my third nugget. I see a Charmander up there. By the way, kid, how would you like to join Team Rocket? That's right. We're a group of dedicated doing evil using Pokemon. Want to join? Are you sure? Come on, join us. I'm telling you to join. Okay, you need convincing. I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. You'll battle me? That That's the offer? I do like that Team Rocket intro. Ooh, a Zubat. Oh, man, so scary. Are you any tougher than the people on the bridge? Alright, let's hit him with Scald. Ooh, oh, okay, I was gonna say, I thought that thing hung on. It looked like it was gonna hang on, and I was like, no freaking way. Coughing. Should just be able to use Scald again. I think Scald will get it done. I'm more interested in this Charmander I see in the background. That's the real interest I have. 73 experience. Team Rocket Grunt. Arr, you are good. 308 bucks. With your skills, you could become a top leader in Team Rocket. Come on, think of the opportunity. You shouldn't let a chance like this pass you by. Okay, I see a Charmander. I'm not going to touch the Charmander yet. So we got a Psyduck. That's a new Pokemon. Three Raspberries. Alright, let's battle the Psyduck. First new Pokemon of this route. I'll probably talk to the, uh, the Charmander person and then call it an episode. 
two, three. Boom, Psyduck. Caught another new Pokemon for the decks. With being able to see what Pokemon are available, Chansey to level 15, nice. I think what I'll do is I'll just catch the new Pokemon on the route and try to limit it to that. Always tormented by headaches, it uses psychic powers, but whether it intends to do so is not known. <laughs> Tucked him away in the box. Alright, I want another Pokemon to spawn. No, okay, it's another Psyduck. We'll just run from this. Another Psyduck. Oop, there we go. There's a Venonat. That's a new Pokemon. Alright. Okay, that did not go the way I wanted it to go. Why is it... I'm going like this and it's going off to the wrong side. There we go. Right down the middle. Get the nice. Yeah. Why is it doing that? Let me try throwing it. Okay, it ran away. I don't know why it's doing that. Not a Pidgey. But, like, usually when I was throwing it like this, it would go the direction that I wanted it to go. <laughs> try this again. Hopefully another Venonat pops up. I don't want the Oddish. Ooh, a Squirtle. Let's go. Let's go. Starter Pokemon. This is what we're looking for right here. Raspberry. Great ball. You will be immediately added to the party, Squirtle. Ooh, wasn't wasn't the greater excellence that I wanted. But will it matter? It will not. Squirtle added to the Pokédex. Let's go. I'm a sucker for the starter Pokemon, especially the Gen 1 starters. Huge sucker for them. Shoots water at prey while in the water, withdraws into its shell when in danger. Okay. So, who's coming out? I guess Oddish is probably coming out. I mean, Oddish doesn't do anything for me right now anyway. If it ever becomes an issue... Oddish can come back in, but I, I haven't really had an issue with this game so far. So I don't really think I need Oddish for what Oddish's purpose is on my team. I mean, currently Oddish's only purpose is to stun or poison or um, what's the other thing I'm trying to think of? Stun, poison, or burn. No, it's not burn. Sleep. Gosh, I couldn't think of it. All right, Venonat, come back so I can end the episode. Not a, not a Pidgey. Wild Oddish, run away. Oh, there's the Venonat. Knew the Venonat couldn't be rare. Obviously, Squirtle is the rare Pokemon in this area. Ooh, the Venonat. Oh no, is that green? That was green. Should mean this is an easy catch since I accidentally threw a great ball. Oh my gosh, it got out. Well, I'm not wasting any more great balls on you. We're going to Pokeballs. And it did it again. There we go. That was a much better throw. You gotta kinda line it up exactly how you want it. And I think if I want it to go that way, I need to go this way. And if I want it to go that way, I need it to go that way. Okay. Because, I mean, truthfully, they want you to throw it like this.
or not. I, it just doesn't. It just doesn't like. It just doesn't like when I try to throw it to the side. So I'm just gonna go op opposite direction like that. Totally weird. Let it so let, let it let it shrink. Ah, oh, let it shrink too far. There we go. Get it. Get. Oh my gosh, the venonat. And I did. I did it. I did it again. I did it again. Where did that? I'm. I'm tired of this, dude. Like, what is this? <laughs> Such a weird. Just catch it, please. Yo, this venonat is unbelievable. What is happening? This is the goat venonat. It is impo It is impossible to catch. This venonat is impossible to catch. Literally impossible. Get in the pokeball. Oh my gosh. This is so stupid. Venonat, get... You're gonna make me use stuff on you. And it ran away. Oh my gosh. Things have gotten real stupid. Here, battle me. I, I need I need something to distract me from the fact that that Venonat broke out of like 15 Pokeballs. What is this? What is this? What is this game? This game cannot be serious with that. I, I, I can't believe that, that that's how that's how that went. Hi ya ha ha! My gosh, uh, I just got trolled by a venonat. Literally trolled by a venonat. Dodge dodging the Pokemon. I'm gonna come up here. Let me pass Pidgey, thank you. I'm gonna come talk to this guy real quick, and then we will go back down there. I'm not good at raising Pokemon. I feel sorry for my Charmander because it's not getting any stronger. So I want to give it to, to give it to a better trainer than me. Are you interested? I've caught 50 Pokemon. You should catch more than that. Okay, like 50 Pokemon in general, or 50 Pokemon in. It's got to be 50 Pokemon in general. How many do I have? Oh, that's not what I wanted. Go to party. Shake it. So we have 6, 12, 18, 24, 35. Okay, I might... After we catch the stupid Venonat, that'll give us 36. I'm going to take the time to catch 9, or 14 of them, or not 14. I'll catch 13 of them off camera while this video is uploading before I start the next part, because I'm going to record the next part tonight. I'll catch 13 more so that at the start of this Venonat, this Venonat, dude. I swear. There's a nice throw. What, what that old, you wanted to, like, shake the Pokeball. Come on, come on, there we go. I have no idea if that meant anything. But shaking the Pokeball, 40 XP. It doesn't matter. It's the Venonat. We needed the stupid Venonat. Tucked him away. Alright, so that's going to do it for this episode, guys. I'm going to catch 39 Pokemon here. Um, and get it so when we start the next episode, we'll get to uh, 49. And I'll catch one in the next episode. And then we can get ourselves Charmander. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop the video like you did, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. Peace out.